Okay, what we are going to talk about in this video is some of the customs which are which were so popular and which were so amazing, but unfortunately not updated from past a long time. Which are those customs? Let's get started. Let's find out some of them. One of my favorite includes Fluid OS. It was so amazing. Even in Android 11 or Android 12, I found this customer was just so amazing in the terms of UI. If you were looking forward to install a best UI UI based customer fluid OS was just something amazing i tried that even i made unofficial version for my device like redmi note 10 pro is you can try out that customer if it is available for your device the quick setting tiles were one of the main highlights of this custom room. That time, these kind of quick setting tiles were so amazing. Also, this custom room still brings you some customization. So if you need a custom room and if it is available yet for your device, maybe of course the old version, you can still give it a try if you just want to. Also, the fonts in this custom room, Fluid OS, was so amazing. Right now, in some of the custom rooms, we have Fluid OS fonts and you can simply check them out. We also have another custom named as Wave OS and it was just so amazing. I tried, I, I remember when I used this custom based on Android 11, that was one of the best. The best performance based custom I tried that on my Redmi Note 9S. I remember me a toll device, Cortana, which was basically the version 4.5, 4.6, 4.8. The last version was for Redmi Note 10 Pro, I think. This was one of the best custom room. It was having very good UI and it was just looking like Oxygen OS style vibes and all the things which was just so amazing. And it was also one of the best customs and forgotten customs because of course it's not updated from past a long time. But this custom was also one of the best. I still miss this custom. Let me know in the comment, comment box if you still use this custom. I mean, I think so. A lot of users are not using that, but still by any chance if you are using. We also have another custom named as XDroid and this custom unfortunately is dead from past some time but previously when it was based on Android 11 it was just so amazing the UI was so nice and also XDroid was based on CAF that time and this CAF based custom was great in the terms of performance it was so smooth as you can see minimalist and the UI interface etc customizations everything was just so amazing one of the best custom was XDroid I think so I tried that and it was having all the customizations by the way all the useful things UI was so good the settings UI was quite impressive also a bit of things are quite unique and that was one of the reasons why i used xdroid on my device i remember i was using this in my device as my daily driver too one of the custom rooms is project arcane it was then renamed to project arcana i think so but the previous version which was project arcane was so good because it was giving you some great ui features good performance everything was so amazing I think so a lot of users are aware of this custom home if you are using custom home from past two or two, two or three years at least because if you're using custom homes from past five to six years you already know some previous custom homes like resurrection remix also but project arcane was also one of the best it was having good ui some features which were present which were actually introduced in android 12 they gave you in android 11 and it was one of the main highlights last but not the least and actually the best in the terms of ui was dot os i think so a lot of users will definitely agree to this thing that dot os when introduced when reintroduced with android 11 having all the android 12 vibes was just so amazing i remember i made a video when dot was released for the first time which was having android 12 features in android 11 the ui was just so nice theming options a lot more things were there this was just more than a room. This was just so, so amazing. And if you did not write this custom room, um, that's quite unfortunate. But this custom room was actually nice. This custom was actually very nice. All the customizations were there. Some features were so nice. Unfortunately for some of the devices, it did not update it for most of the time. But for a few, two or three updates, this custom was nice. I used that in Redmi Note 10 Pro. I used that in Mi 11X also, I think. But yes, these were things I just wanted to let you know. These were the five custom rooms, which are actually so amazing. Make sure to give them a try if you want to. Goodbye.